before I get into this article and show you the shoes, just remember there's been a lot of companies that made Star Wars shoes over the years. And I don't know. These are Adidas, the Rise of Skywalker Adidas, you know, Ultra Boost that they're going to release right before the movie. Um, first glance, I will say they look better than these shoes. But I'm not sure if they could compare to the comfort of the Chewy Crocs on a cold, brisk winter's eve. But anyway, Adidas is coming out with the Rise of Skywalker shoe uh, modeled after an X-Wing. And in this article written by <laughs> none other than Luke, he's like, and... Um, He's going to share his thoughts with this release that they're they're coming out here. It says, perhaps hoping to recapture a little of the magic from their older collaborations. Uh, we've been saying that about the new movies. <laughs> Maybe they're trying to recapture a little bit of the magic. Just a little bit of the magic. Um, let's see. The result is this X-Wing inspired Ultra Boost. <laughs> Yeah, it says it should be great, but despite losing its hyper beast luster, it still may be Adidas' best sneaker silhouette. And definitely it's most comfortable. And who doesn't love X Wings? Ah, look at that here. I don't like the gray thing up here. It just the colors are just kind of funny when they match. And he goes, and yet look at this thing. It's an adult sneaker with a four-year-old's Kmart shoe aesthetic. <laughs> Is Kmart even still around? I don't think I've seen a Kmart. I don't remember the last time I've seen a Kmart. That's pretty pretty bad. There's print on the boost and heel cup that looks like it was applied in Microsoft Word. <laughs> Wow. Wow. I, I don't know what's funnier, me trying to read English uh, or just laughing at what they're saying here. So the heel tab has a super corny, the force will be with you always slogan running all the way down it. And worst of all, it's based off the shoes S and L model, which is it's mesh construction. It is the absolute worst ultra boost. Maybe the Star Wars name will give it a boost. See what I did? Yeah. There it is. The force will be with you all the way down. All the way down. Oh, I clicked on the photo. Uh, yeah. Yeah, he's not too happy with the design, Mr. Luke. There's the uh, Rebel Insignia. Yeah, they just kind of look like uh, Old Man Shoe. Uh, he says, if you're really into these, these were much better, the ones that came out back in 2010. I didn't own these either. That orange and gray uh, mesh is just kind of... It, it just, you know, you usually have shoes that, that kind of pop. I have two pairs of these Ultra Boost, actually. I have black ones. Uh, got a black pair. And uh, I actually got a white pair. I don't know what outfit I would have to go with this. Uh, I guess I could wear the typical old man black t-shirt and camouflage shorts with the <laughs> uh, which I own sadly uh, this doesn't even go with like Harley Davidson orange because of this weird these weird colors right here I don't know maybe it'll grow on me what do you guys think you gonna buy this you gonna pick these up for the movie that's coming out in December so you could show the world that you're a true fan I wonder what they're going to cost. That's the other thing. It's like, are they going to overcharge because it's a Star Wars theme thing, uh, shoe? But I don't know. What you guys got? What you guys got? You going to cop? You going to drop? You going to buy? Are they, are they fire? Or uh, they need to be thrown in the fire? I don't know. You tell me. <laughs> All right. That's the video. It is what it is, man. It does what it does. It does what it does. <laughs> I'll catch you next time.